I've mentioned in my video that Stock Cezanne, that like in any other brand, Cezanne has pieces that worth the investment and others that you should avoid. And I thought I could do this by categories, otherwise this would be a very extensive video. So today we are talking knitwear. I know fall hasn't yet arrived and days are still pretty warm, but we also know that Cezanne's knits and pieces in general sell out very quickly. So I thought that as soon as you have this list, the better, as this video could help you in case you're considering buying some new knits, either to enlarge your existing collection or if you're someone who has just discovered Cezanne and want to start investing in some good gems that will elevate your outfits and will last you for many years to come. I thought I could uh, then separate the knitwear pieces also by fabric composition in a way that you have like a complete guide that you can follow and choose according to your preferences. That is, uh, you will have first all the knits made in 100% yak wool, so the top quality. Indeed, Cezanne has introduced some good gems made in high quality soft wool that they call more amour and these are new in knits made in even softer, lighter and warmer wool. So let's begin. With knits made in 100% yak wool. And I will be uh, talking and explaining what is this wool in a minute. So the first one is the Lauren jumper. Let us first talk about the design of this jumper that we can see it's slightly oversized. It has a high collar. It seems that is not too tight. So I think this will be very, very comfortable and also will protect our neck from the cold winter winds. This jumper is available in camel, in mottled grey and in green. Ok, let's now then talk about the yak wool. So the yak wool is known to be one of the most softest wool in the world. When we compare yak wool with alpaca, we know that they're both soft and popular for high quality and both are more environmentally sustainable than cashmere. Yak wool is generally more durable. Additionally, yak wool may be slightly warmer than alpaca because its higher cream allows it to retain more heat. What about yak wool versus merino wool? Yak and merino are extremely similar. Yak is almost like a super version of merino. It's a, a little more antimicrobial, a little more thermoregulating, a little softer and a little more expensive as well. And finally, we are comparing yak wool versus cashmere. Yak wool is often considered a sustainable alternative to cashmere. It's soft like cashmere and easy to care for. It's also 30% warmer and two times more breathable. Knowing all this, I'm very pleased that Cezanne has introduced some new pieces made in yak wool. And this brings us to the next knit, which is the Tommy vest. This vest has a round neckline and, in my opinion, these sleeveless knits are great to layer under thick coats, particularly in winter, without the bulk of the sleeves. The Tommy is available in camel and in vintage blue. So there's a color perfect for those who have a cool a skin undertone and for those who have a warm skin undertone. This next uh, knit it's the Maurice jumper. It has a round neckline. It's shorter than the Lauren without being too cropped. At the moment you can just choose between blue and black. The JD cardigan is the last one Cezanne has made in yak wool for now. This is perfect for those who prefer a cardigan over a jumper. So this cardigan has a V-shaped neckline, it's slightly cropped, a little oversized and it has patch pockets on the front. It's available in green and in camel. I was lacking these more plain knits in my wardrobe and I just placed an order with the Lauren in camel, the Maurice in black 
you can't go wrong with the black jumper and the JD cardigan in green and I'm eager to receive them of course I will be then reviewing and styling them for you <music>